Well, I have to admit, <laughs> I was fooled. I think Tim yeah. Reynolds was fooled. I think Mike Cunha was fooled. We all were fooled <laughs> yeah. because we were absolutely convinced that Super Bowl 53 was going to be a shootout. But, Mike, the only fireworks we saw in this game were before the game. Yeah, before the game, maybe the <laughs> halftime show, you yeah. got a, a SpongeBob uh, appearance. What happened to the offenses here? The offense disappeared. Well, I don't want to say they disappeared because I do want to give the defenses credit. Yeah. Uh, Brian Forrest, Wade Phillips on the other side for the Rams. Uh, they did a heck of a job. I mean, you have to be honest here. Holding any team in today's NFL uh, era under 20 points in any game. But the is Rams punted, what, eight, easy. nine times in a row, Tim? Yeah. Adam Levine threw for as many touchdowns as Jared Goff and Tom Brady <laughs> combined. That was the problem with this game. Mike's absolutely right. It was a masterful job by the yeah. defense, just a more masterful job by Bill Belichick's side yeah. and Tom Brady with those two unbelievable touch passes to Gronk to set up Sony Michelle's Broward kid. Sony Michelle's touchdown run to end up really winning it for the Patriots. They came through when they had to, and that's been the Patriot M.O. now for 17 years and counting. It's not the truth. That's certainly been the Tom Brady M.O., particularly this season as mm -hmm. they uh, rallied to beat the Chiefs and then on, of course, to win the Super Bowl last night. So now Brady's got six rings, Mike. Yeah. Can we say absolutely unequivocally that he is the GOAT? Oh, we've talked about it, you know, a, a lot recently. He was the GOAT coming into this game. It, it didn't matter what he did here, but yeah. You talk about Tom Brady, you talk about the big game, the big pass, the big drive. You want one guy NFL history, he's the one. There's no one else.